Can you believe a mid-grade light grew all of this? What's up reefers? And as the title suggests, Reef Atlantis has been running mid-grade reef lights since the beginning. When I first got the idea to start growing coral, I assumed I was gonna buy the best light on the market. I have this saying, buy it nice or buy it twice. I didn't come up with it. It's just some funny thing my dad used to say and he was crazy about having the right tool for the right job. So I was a little nervous buying this light for the first tank. I don't normally buy mid-grade products, especially when it's such an important aspect of the hobby. I had everything for the tank upgrade except lighting, and every one I wanted to buy had a huge price point compared to Vipar Spectra's. My biggest concern was if this light could do what it was claiming. I started browsing YouTube for videos of anyone using it, and to my surprise, there wasn't much. There were a few, however, so I ended up taking the risk, and it turned out to be a great purchase the light grew all of my coral with zero problems. When I went through the first tank upgrade, I ended up getting a second one for more tank coverage. Here's a list of specs. You can go ahead and pause now if you'd like to take a closer look. If you're here to learn how to use the light, go ahead and skip through to the end using the chapter features. And always, if you like what you see, swim on down to that subscribe and like button so we can keep on bringing you awesome reefing content. Reef Atlantis is roughly two feet deep, and Vipar's lights have a pretty good strength at that depth. But to get enough power across the entirety of the tank, I needed to string three of these together. Now these lights aren't without flaws, but to be honest, I don't think any light is. It's actually tough to use and took me a while to figure out the controls, but that's what this video is for. So I can provide that peace of mind I didn't have when purchasing, and to show you how to use it. The remote is a standard dinky remote, and this is what gave me problems. If I had spent top dollar on a light, it would have come with a user-friendly app that I control from my phone, but I didn't. So let's talk about how to work this thing. To start, this remote has two buttons at the top, one for power and the other to access the menu. Below, that is a directional pad with a center OK button used for selecting. You can also access the menu with the OK button. Repeatedly pressing OK cycles through the menu options. There are three menu options, channel one, channel two, and HSE. The C1 button controls the on timer for the blue light, and the C1 off button controls the off timer for the blue light. The C2 on button does the same, but for the white light, and the C2 off button controls the off timer. The preview button lists settings values for each of your settings. So that's it for today's vid. Ultimately, I love this light and would recommend it to reefers everywhere. So keep on swimming and I'll see you guys next time.